Okay, welcome back to Northern Ants Gaming. My name is Mark. This is Pantopia. We are at episode three. When we left off last time, we had gotten enough research points to get our coal generator up, and we were able to also get our lights positioned in the roof of in the ceiling of the base. So now, when it gets dark, we'll be able to see in here better. This is our fuel. You have to keep coal in there to keep it running and that will affect your base life expectancy you know it starts decaying when you're not running power so right now let's see stored power none but we are we've got a one day 13 hours we've got active power 14 or 47 kilowatts okay well like I said in the la end of the last episode, I promised we were going to try attacking. There's a creature that's been roaming around down here. And we are going to grab our nail gun. And we are going to see if we can't take it out with that. Don't know how fast it is or how strong it is compared to the nail gun. But hopefully it will give us a lot of research points that we can then use to upgrade our weapons. That's if it's still around. Which, unfortunately, it looks like it's not. Oh, okay. Well, let's take a run out there and see if we can't find something else to shoot then. <laughs> but there was a couple things here that we could could have attacked. Usually they spawn in the same spots. you got to remember to listen because a lot of times you'll hear them before you see them. Oh, that's what we want to do. Let's get some of these. Want to get fruit set up in all of these spots because if you're getting attacked, it's always good to have them in position to be able to use them. Well, that stinks not seeing any sign of them. Oh, good. This is a coal deposit, it looks like. Now that we got our power generator going, we need to have as much coal as we can. We can eventually get a nuclear power generator, so we'll need to get plutonium and things like that. And there are rare materials, but to be able to collect them, we need to have better mining tools, which in turn we need to be able to kill more stuff to get the research points to be able to get those tools. So it seems to be, as of right now, the hardest part of that is actually finding stuff to shoot. <laughs> I did find a few nests in the last episode. Fortunately, the first episode didn't get all that many views yet, but I was kind of expecting it from a game that's been kind of MIA for so many years. Hopefully it'll start, people will start noticing it again, and we'll start getting some views on these videos. Because this is one that I really do enjoy playing, so I'm hoping it's one that'll be popular, so it makes it worth being able to play, it keep, keeps it worth playing it. Because it's not really worth it if I'm only getting like 9 views on a video. to continue spending the time to make it. Gotta be something around here we can shoot. Oh, there's a... Oh, good. That's one of those rare minerals that higher value. Let's see, what is it? A uh, rare platinum material. Good. Let's see, once we collect a bunch of those, we'll have to jump on our hover bike and head over to one of the facilities and trade that stuff in. Get the credits, because then you can use those credits to buy other things. A lot of times that's how I get my auto miner, or my laser miners and stuff like that, that we need for that, that outcropping down there in the water. So one of those things that you need a higher level mining tool to be able to get it. one thing this game is is it's a lot of uh, 
a lot of mining. But when you get also, when you get a, a mech, you can actually put uh, mining arms on the mechs, which makes it a whole lot easier to get minerals. And I'm liking all these scattered around minerals. That's something that's new with the new updates. So this is what I talk about. See, so watch. Yeah, it sees you need at least a tier one mining tool to get to re to harvest that. So props to the developers of the game for finally coming back and you know doing work on it. They may have been doing work on it for for years. I just they said they they're a little too radio silent on on their work, at least on the the uh, Steam page. And after a few years, I kind of stopped following it because it was just getting frustrating. Okay, well, I was out looking for something to attack and did not find anything. But I did gather quite a bit of, quite a few minerals. So add to our furnaces and power generators. And is that the car? And put some of the felspar in there too because we do have quite a bit we did get a oh wow i didn't even realize we got rare platinum we got rare diamond rare silver and another rare platinum oh, we're getting a pretty good stockpile of uh items for taking for trade let's take and get all of the rare minerals in one Let's see. Oh wow, we got a lot of felspar. And oh wow. Hmm. I guess it does have enough space for stuff, huh? And I do know I have another the other container's got these a lot of the fruits in them too. So we are going to grab out of here Let's grab all this fruit out of there and we're gonna put all of these rare minerals in here because that stuff will take with us when we head out to one of the main bases okay let's don't need to carry all that with us put that in there we don't need all that false bar with us Let's put half of it we don't need all that actually we don't need any of it on us right now if we're not building anything like that and let's uh, we should probably make some more nails can we just do as many as uh, I guess we'll just go up with it until we can't build anymore. Yeah, that should be enough. It'll leave us a little bit of a little bit of metal on us, and we got an extra gun. Okay, let's take a look. Now, can we save here? Uh, that's strictly for a spawn point, I was. Okay, we need to find something to shoot. Hopefully we can get quite a bit from from this, their sails. Okay, let's grab all these. Oh, I want to grab that other extra power cell too, just in case. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> I 
do like that you can skim across the top of the water too. Nice, it's right there. Hopefully, we'll maybe we'll be able to get ourselves a better mining tool. Okay. Let's see. Let's sell stuff. I wonder if it's. You know, like, you get more different stations. Ooh, that was a good one. 1720. The diamonds, see what we get for that. What? Oh, diamonds must not be something that is to be sold. That's different. Okay. Um, by some of these you need higher ranks to buy. Okay, let's look at the other. Trading edge. See, I don't know why you'd want to buy parts to your base, because they're fairly easy to build. That's a little bit Better quality gun, I think. Meaning that it would probably last longer. Buyer fee. Uh, let's look at some other, these other stations first. stuff that we can make ourselves. Okay. I wonder if it's just if it's all the same. Oh no, they are different. You mean I've got to go to each one of these little robots? Because each one has something different. I like the armor. Let's buy one of the armor, see if it's something that we now can put in our suit. Oh yeah, see these are all the different ships and mechs and tomahawk, that's nice. Yeah, see all these guns. Once you start, once you get upgraded, you get, you're able to buy better things too. Once we get that other, uh, let's see, the the refinery, we'll be able to start building better materials. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. Uh, let's see, does it show how we can equip it? In plants, light clothes. I don't know if that's classified that like it's. Hmm. Now yeah, we'll put it there and see if that helps with anything. Doesn't look like it. See, so we don't need a standard research center, standard. Yeah, see those are all standard. We don't need those. Large cargo container. We've already got two, so we don't really need another one of those right now. Okay, I guess there's really not much that we need that they're offering at this moment. So I guess we head back to our base. 
Well, I think we're going to leave it off right there. And in the next episode, we're, we're going to continue our journey around trying to find stuff to shoot. <laughs> Hopefully we'll find something. We'll see what else we can come across. So thank you so much for watching. I do really appreciate it. Remember, hit that like button, comment down below. Don't forget, subscribe if you've not done so. I really appreciate it. Have a great rest of your day. Well, this video is ending, but the nice thing is, is if you hit that subscribe button and the bell icon, you'll get notifications when the next video comes out. Take this opportunity to go over to my homepage and check out some of my other videos. I have a wide variety of different topics, so I hope you enjoy them. Have a great rest of your day, and I will talk to you in the comments.